Hello there, peeps. Celine here, and welcome back to Psychoden. Bye. Uh, we're looking around the city, and we're meeting Jean. Oh, no, apparently Jean's not here. off today. Oh, come on, you serious? Because we will need them. I'm put weight on her. And I'm not putting another one on him. Jean's not there, sadly. I don't really care. How does one hit? You did it. Really good drum drops for you. Ow. Oh. There's the pearl. Their swords were ex mercenaries for starfish. They got smashed in the in the sword back off with the queen. That pissed off some other customers. And there you have it. I 
wasn't done looking around town. Oh. Armor shop. I won't be finding every single, uh, chest, but I will be keeping an eye out for them as much as possible. Item in Trading hall. Oh, and Kimmy's weapon is rings, like the anti. There's a cheat for, uh, for, uh, SP. Well, that doesn't give me all the ones I want. I'll be right back. Okay. I got the cheat that I actually wanted. It's the max party uh, S XP or SP that will let me do this. Cause he can only go up so high, anyways.
I don't think he ever uses that. I know he uses this later on. You want know, to know the sad thing is? I don't think I ever did this. Oh, this magic was already level D. Yeah, tune out what it says on party. It could have uh, jumped around a lot. That's magic. Dude. on all of this. Which at some point in the game I will be doing this off camera. Because again, we have 108 effing stars of destiny. But only like 30 of them are fighters. Maybe 50 of them. No, I want to say 85 of them are fighters. Oh god. Why? We definitely needed that one. Because hell. Attack. Defense. I'm not doing Kyle. Because we won't keep him. I'm only focused on Flay and Alora. Or whatever her name is. Leor. Leon. Because, uh, they're the only two stars we technically have right now. Because we're not collecting stars yet. This is the place I was actually looking for. There's one, yeah, there's one more chest. And that's all the chests in this town. Trading. I need to buy two, three salt. Uh, that's 
fine. Fruit has skyrocket. I don't care. We need six salts. Well, I already got two, so every chance you get, buy some salt. You need at least ten of them. All right, we did our shopping. Let's go back to the palace. Sire, Her Majesty the Queen is... I know. But until I leave, don't let anybody disturb us, no matter who it is. Oh, oh yes. Certainly, Your Majesty. Arshtot, I'm here. Poor dear, I thought you look... I thought you looked like this. Like what? Do I really look that bad? No, of course not. You're as beautiful as ever. I still wish I could freeze time and stare at your face. But that's all I worry now. Are you worried about play? Yes, both children. And my sister. I'm a terrible sister. And a worse mother. You know that's not true. Visiting Lakewood in my place. That must have been such an odd ordeal for Flay. I had such kind words prepared for his welcome home. And look what I did. Look what I said to him. To my sister. To my knights. I couldn't control myself. I can't couldn't stop thinking. I'm right. I'm of whatever justice. Those who sin against me should be punished. It came out of nowhere, Fred. It took, it takes me over. Just like the time two years ago. The sunroom, just as we thought. Yes. The old legends say the sunroom Produce its possessor's soul. I can't believe it. I can't afford it to. But now, you should just take that room removed once and for all. I know, I know, you can't, right? Not yet. If I remove it right now, I'll be playing right into Godwin's hands. It wasn't to punish. Like, would, like I took the rune up in the first place, after all. But I did. I lost control. I used it, and I was wrong. Completely wrong. I'm prepared to live with that responsibility. But my children shouldn't suffer for my sins. They're young. They'll understand someday. Yeah, I think Flay understands faster than you think. Our children, your sister, they're strong. Have faith in them. But I'm a, really am a terrible mother. Or a terrible sister, a terrible mother. Here I am blessed with a wonderful husband and children. And thanks, I give, I forbid my sister to worry. 
I tried to marry my daughter off to some whatever son, whether she likes it or not. That's all part of being of a queen, my dear. Of course, if it's more than you can bear, we can always run off in the night. Uh, there you go, trying to tip me again. It does sound nice, but we can't run away just yet. Not with Lord Godwin hungering for the throne. We can't let Flora fall to the likes of him. True. It's been a long time since we've seen the sunset from here, hasn't it? Prince, what do you think is going to happen to us? I mean, this nation. When I saw how Lord Lake and the town were, I started feeling uneasy. Like everyday life wasn't going to keep on going on like before. Like something was about to happen. But of course, you know I'll protect you no matter what happens. Prince. Right. Can't have the bodyguard getting all anxious now, can we? Now then, Prince Plague, my sister. I wish for you to proceed to the Storm Fist and supervise the preparations to the, for the Sacred Games. I'm thinking if that's for my own good. Queen Knight Jork Prime, Queen's Knight Princess Leon, I order you to accompany them. In one week, the day before the opening ceremony, We'll arrive in. Okay. Until then, you'll be my. Whatever. Remember that. Let our mercy, as deep as whatever, in authority, as as powerful as the sun, be revealed by the entire world. Let everyone have mercy. Okay. See, in this part of the game, uh, Kimmy's actually allowed to go, too. But the old man knows. Yeah. I like the old man. even a kid aren't you how come everyone else gets to go off with you and all I do is see you off no fair uh, very important business but father <laughs> oh god. Not go. He's funny. You're frequently my third child, you know. As I see it, I am tall 
you have a little flower you stirred every now and then. Actually, no, I think uh, the prince will ask, will personally, will personally ask Kimmy to stay behind to keep his sister company. And she would arrive with the sister and mom. Because even though he's silent, uh, in comics or mangas that I read, and yes, I read a uh, Yaoi ones too. I do believe, uh, or in the comics, he does actually talk. So, that's why I say that he personally asked Kimmy to stay behind for his sister. I wonder how far we're going to get today. Or in this recording session, I wonder how far we're going to get. I'm sorry, a lot of the notification sounds were getting on my nerves. That's pretty. I know it's just a water road. Uh, showing the route to the town. Yay. We stopped. Why did we stop? Oh. 
This is such a nice wind, isn't it? Yes. If it keeps up like this, we should reach Stormfest by tomorrow afternoon. Nice we can go almost anywhere by ship, even though this is an inland nation. Yeah, thank goodness for the Fatus River. But the convenience of the river has its disadvantages, too. I mean, we've been doing nothing but traveling lately. If we didn't have the Fatus, I bet we wouldn't have to take trips all over the place. Huh. Don't know about that. The Queen doesn't exactly strike me as the merciful type. No, you're wrong about the Queen. Her Majesty is really very kind. Right, Prince? That's right. It may be a bit strange for me to say, but Arstadt was a very gentle and good Queen. Yeah, I can tell. Everybody in town loves her. And Farad obviously loved her enough to marry her. But if you ask me, though, she seems kind of unstable at the moment. I'm not surprised. From your point of view, you've only known Arstadt since she acquired the Sun Rune. So, she was different before? Yes. After getting the Sun Rune, Her Majesty changed. And... And I think it's getting gradually worse. I'm really worried. What's wrong, George? Lady Silence, watch out! Both of you, get away from the side of the ship! Something's coming! <sighs> what the hell is that? No. No! <gasps> I hate lizards! <gasps> it's a lizard. Oh, <sighs> that was really disgusting. <sighs> What's going on? Don't come over yet. Stay out of sight. And tell the crew not to leave their posts. Yes, ma'am. Leon, what do you mean? Damn. Oh, I can't take this anymore. <gasps> It's the Godwin family ship. Is that... Gazelle? Okay, I'm hitting it here. So we're meaning, uh... Auntie's, uh, ex-fiance. 
I have to say, he's actually pretty good looking for a uh, bad guy. I can't really say the son's a bad guy. I know his father is, but I can't really say the son is because he's more uh, listening to his father. So, I don't know. But he's still an enemy, so take that with a grain of salt. But anyway, peeps, we're all time. So leave me a like, comment, subscribe if you haven't, and we will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!